a NASA space shuttle with this. <laughs> Probably. <yes. laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. So let's oh. see, my. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Only, only, only thing I, uh, I don't believe is is seven to ten years. Everything else I can believe. Only, only, only thing I, uh, I don't believe. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Where is the chat? I have to put the chat. So let's say the stream. Hello and welcome to the Sahib show and welcome to the Albion online. I'm here to help you out. Any questions you have, please feel free to answer them. So we are now also live. So I hope everything goes well. Uh, let's see where is this chat. Chat, we chat, we chat, we chat. Where is this chat? Haven't done a stream so, uh, so, so long time. I am still connecting. Seriously? Wow. Yeah, I think it takes time. Okay, let's see if I'm, I'm going to the... Oh my god. Oh, that's your island? Yep, I got this 20 of tombs, so let's go there. Fame, come on, fame. This was some reward. 200,000 fame, imagine that. <laughs> Insane. Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> what else to say? Okay, I have to put chat also in this window, so... One second, I'm looking how I can do that. Yeah, you can uh, create your island and then you can uh, create there, put your things and... Um, first, I think I take up my crops so you see where, where you can make lots of money. Ah, there is this icon. Okay, I'll put here. So uh, now, if, uh, if you... I can see on the, the chat window in the other screen so I can see the discord uh, chat if you if somebody uh, writes right. me there. So, I see, hello. so is is the island a viable way to make some decent money uh, yes one second Okay, then uh, Goku Vibe asks, any tips for a new guy? <clears throat> okay, first tip for the new guy. Uh, if you start the game, I highly, highly, highly suggest please do the first um, these uh, quests, what you got, uh, first missions, because you got 100 learning points there. The, to get 100 learning points, if you don't have premium, you have to wait 10 days and do the other daily missions. Or if you have a premium, it takes you five days. Now you can have them uh, faster than half an hour. Also, you get Royal Sigil if you do the, the next quest, what you get uh, if you go uh, off to this uh, beginner's island. 
and then you're gonna get this royal cheat shield which is worth now uh, 30 40 thousand it is huge money for starters so that's the first tip and for you the island uh, if you are now uh, checking the stream then you see the crops here there is crops and you can yeah you can grow different things um you can grow uh I'm showing here you can grow carrots beans weeds turnip cabbage blah 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 blah, blah these things and then uh, you can use like i'm using here this is like uh, where you can grow all the oh okay all the other things like uh, what's the these things like dragon diesel like uh, they are like herbs or something and um, and also you can uh, grow uh, chickens uh, gooses lambs pigs and you can grow mounts even and horses and oxes and uh, later you can grow even wild animals which is like very rare uh, Coco Vibe asks um, what are these points used for the learning points uh, if you hit B like banana you see I have here uh, 15 learning points and they are used to um, get faster uh, your skills up let's see what what I have here to learn uh, I have I have let's do that so here is a cloth go fighter for me like uh, this is level so you can go 66 to 100 but uh, and and there is this needed 171,220 fame I have 180,000 to 18,000 done so now when i want to save these 60000 i need three learning points so 15 here three here and i hit learn and it's done so you can you can like uh, if you get these 100 learning points i think uh, you can uh, you can go up to tier 5 so what's tier tier is the like levels in this game so when you start you are novice the next level there is a trainee so this is tier 2 so it's like level 2 and tier 8 is maximum so uh, when you when you want to um, use this tier to get next one then you have to complete this mission here let's say to get tier 2 you need 1350 and you cannot use learning points here yet so now this is done now you can choose who you want to become do you want to come to the fighter or you want to come um, hunter or mage or or mix of these you can be tank healer you can be mage tank you can be hunter there, I don't know what you you can there is so many options because different uh, items have different spells on them and this game is all about you are what you wear so if you are um, naked you will die like in milliseconds if you wear something even if you are like uh, Novice, you can wear, wear very good things. So let's see. The game starts, real game starts when you do the changes in here, when you are whatever tier 4, these specializations. But first, you are journeyman and then you make the, your, the choice. Do you become hunter or or, or here? mage or healer <clears throat> but uh, 
but to choose in tier 3 it's very crucial here you have to make decision what's on your head what's on your chest what's on your boots what's on your hand and the other hand why because let's say you want to uh, you want to do much damage so the most damage you can do is for mage items so this is the journeyman you have to take this journeyman uh, scholar robe and here if you go up you see there is cloth robe fighter now here is seven different cloth robes and uh, if you click you see the spells so all the cloth robes give you at least 40% of physical and magical attack bonus. This is the most in game. The best one gives you, this is here, 50 and here you get 8 more, 58% of physical or magical attack bonus. But downside is armor is very weak. Um, yeah, you're the you're the quintessential glass cannon, right? Lots of damage, no defense. True, totally true. Also, when you go, when you go to the next, let's go here. Check out where is that leather jacket fighter. It's kind of twenty or uh, twenty five or even thirty percent of physical bonus, but much more defense there. If you go to the plate, so there is so much more. So it's almost double defense. Uh, but if you go down here, no attack bonus at all. No attack bonus at all. If you go to the lighter plate, there is 200. It's still almost two, but there is 10%. But see the spells in this game i can honestly say doesn't matter absolutely doesn't matter what build you make so for question for you what class would you say is the best koku vibe there is no best i have seen so crazy builds like human mind can say it doesn't work and then he comes and choo 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 and you're gone and I have seen so strong tanks and then mage comes and toos hutch hutch and it's gone. So what in this game is so 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 purely uh, skill and what you wear based. And, and there is always always there is um, counter skill. If you, keep, if you see someone and you say oh I can't I can't like fight him or um, it's impossible to uh, defeat him if, always possible yesterday I saw the build I, I never uh, have seen yet the guy used uh, uh, one cape like I have uh, not, not that cape was another cape but was doing the um, ground like slime which take damage and he just frees you and then if you want to uh, freeze comes off after three seconds he slowed you and uh, after three seconds or four seconds I was dead I almost can't do nothing and I was like blown away I had 2.5 million silver set on me and I have played three and a half years this game I have seen so much things and still I get surprised and that's why I love this game it's never to be like, oh my god, I know everything. You can't do that. <laughs> uh, then I would say there is a best because you can swap mid combat adaptation. The situation is also depends on what you wish to play and enjoy playing. That's so true. 
Okay, so how do I so, so <laughs> long name here? Ah, can I call you dragons? Yeah, what's up? Yeah, dragons. That's so true. Uh, I will totally agree with you because um, if you if you use the set which you enjoy, if you use the weapon which you enjoy, you can't go wrong. Only what you can do is go better by training and training and training. There is no best build. Um, what I can also suggest to the Koku vibe is um, if you want to stay uh, stay alive a little bit longer, start with uh, tank build. Maybe maybe you can take TPS weapon like I have here. Uh, this is uh, extreme. It's too too expensive for starters, but uh, take some uh, weapon which is oh, there is spears i can suggest you spears take spear like this spear it has uh, 77 you can jump you can do 500 if you have these charges very good damage or you can uh, you can even take a bow if you want to uh, avoid hitting and um, and if you start the game this is the map and uh, sorry this is black zones royal continent there where you can start you s usually you start some uh, some crosses this is swamp cross there is uh, should be mountain cross yeah, there is a uh, forest wow. cross. Uh, yeah, wow. <laughs> and yeah, <laughs> mostly you, 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 you can't fast travel or it is so expensive. So this is wow. <laughs> this is all about traveling to uh, using your oxes or horses or food. That's why you need to get the royal horse immediately. Yeah. And uh, if you if you start the game, be on the blue zones. Look, blue, blue, blue means it's safe. Safe. Yeah, you can knocked off. It means monsters kill. There, no players can attack you there. If you don't have faction, I will say uh, tell about faction later. But if monster kills you, you knocked. Uh, get knocked down there is some cool down time when you're gonna go, go up and uh, you lose 10 percent whatever is in your bag let's say you have 100 metal you lose 10 metal every time you get knocked off and your gear what you use all your care uh, durability gets down 10 percent so this is the only downside then there is a um, yellow zone. Their player can attack you if they're hostile. And the, the, the rules are same. They cannot kill you. They can only knock you down. So rules same. 10% what you're in your back. 10% of um, you wearing the durability. If, but if you go to the red zone, welcome. <laughs> there is full PvP. You lose everything every single thing it's in your bag or what you wear every single one only the gold and silver will stay so be careful there this is full pvp there or later you see every city has this line going up yeah red blue green it means Let's take this Lumhurst. It transports the portal, transports here or here. This is black zones, yeah. There is also full loot, but much, much better resources, much, much higher monsters. Uh, you can make much, much more money there and so forth. 
but when you are in the red zone uh, one second <clears throat> in the red zone there you can see how many uh, hostile characters in the zone when you are in the blue zone you go down where is your map and there is ah oh, you can't see there is my uh, this there but you can see let's say it's 50 pe people there if if in the, in the red or yellow zone then there is hostile counter and it see it it's uh, shows you how many hostile persons let's say you see there is two hostiles okay you can write through because if you are if you if you um, take right route you're still alive but if there is five or four stay away but if you're in the black zone there is no counter there there, there may be eh, nobody, but there may be hundred people there. You don't know. So cool. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Yeah. Go ahead and shoot me that in bot, man. Up. What? 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 One sec. Uh, can you whisper me something? Ah, oh, you whispered already. Uh, I'm ready for the event. Okay, now I'm see. Yeah. Where is, where is, where is? Uh... Ah, don't run. Dark. There. This. What? He said, ah, you are in the tutorial zone now or what? Oh, it won't work? I think not. He, he said uh, something. It was Dalk. Uh, Dalk RSA. XA. Kings. Can I copy this? Yes. You can you can't invite players who are in the tutorial. Okay, finish the tutorial and I'm happy all to right, do it. Again. Right. I'm working on it now. Yeah, no problem there. So Goku Vibe uh, says so it's high risk, high reward game. True. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, but there is so much you can do. So much you can do to avoid cankers, so much you can do that you won't die. Uh, also, 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 I will. Uh, one second here. That game looks amazing. Thank you. Yeah, it is. It, it, in, in like first week, you are, you are like uh, in the needle. You're like, oh, so I think. <laughs> Uh, I think when uh, the game started, I was like uh, two weeks. I was like waking up straight to the computer, then paid whew, like 10, 12 <laughs> hours, then sleep, then next one again. <laughs> it was crazy. Oh, yeah. Um. This video, oh, that's the video I wanted. No, not right now. Mm. And uh, when you are looking for nice and friendly guild to join, look here. We have, yeah, Guild Wolfstack, which is mostly for the the purpose for this guild is to create a fantastic community. That's the only vision here. So people can uh, feel like uh, they are uh, 
they count, they are at home, they are a good community, everyone supports and and we select people only for the like the people people can join. <laughs> Okay, there is next question there. Mm. Uh, how close the com uh, how does the economy work in this game? Because I heard it has a player driven one. True. That's also why um why I joined the game one of their main reasons is that every single item, every single item is made by player. All the items, even if the monster drop them. And there is, um, in the Carleon, there is a black marketer, this guy, uh, who will uh, buy things. So, you make things, you go there, you can sell your things in different cities in the auction houses and uh, there is only the players who buy, sell and and trade and then there is the black marketer which will uh, see if monsters packs are fulfilled if some monster, let's say there is uh, there was like um, 100 bags dropped today so now black marketer says oh my god sees that uh, there is a uh, lack of the bags and uh, he will put very good prices on these bags so maybe you are bag maker go to the black marketer sell your bags there make high profit and now your bags drops on these monsters across the map or the Whoa. chests what whoa I'm in the tutorial and there's there's probably 70 80 people here. I'm slightly overwhelmed. <laughs> oh yeah. I I imagine what's going on because um when when the game started, I don't know how much th there was like uh there was so hard to uh, gather something or uh, it was like so overcrowded. But yeah, I I played these alpha versions and betas before, so I, I I knew exactly where to go. So I was like so so much ahead of maps. So yeah, That's so much easier. So uh, also, if you want to, um, if you want to do fast and avoid much people, finish your uh, the starter quest as soon as you can. And then depends what you want to do. If you want to be gatherer, choose only one resource. One. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, see if you can get as fast as you can get to the like yellow zones to gather this resource. Because uh, so few people are willing to go to the t take this little risk because in the yellow zone okay you get gank but you lose only 10 percent but the resources are there there are few people and there is so much better resources there Uh, only thing what what this game's uh, game uh, needs more is that uh, you cannot repair your armor or weapon. This should be taken away, and also the solar missions, more solar missions we need. And why repair taken away? Because then uh, crafters have more work, or then uh, only uh, let's let's say uh, you make sword. And only you can repair the sword. So if you sell the sword, uh, then the people who person who bought your sword, your sword comes back and says, "Please, can you repair my sword?" You are yes. For this price, I will do it. Then would be very good. For what's your thoughts? 
Uh, I think I think a repair system is needed. Yeah. Also very good that things things will break in this game. Let's say you get uh, killed, then uh, uh, it's possible that some things uh, go trash in your inventory, even 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 what you wear. Or uh, in red zone, if if people kill you, some things they can't take. It it, it may go trash. Oh. Well, it's also it's also a good money sink. That way, it keeps hyperinflation down of the economy. Yeah. Okay. Also, ah, okay. I'm, I'm talking a little bit about these uh, growing things. Um, okay, there is a when you start, there is uh, different cities where you can uh, start your island. But be aware, uh, if you start your island, um, I will show you. Will taxes, you right? Uh, no, not even taxes, but location. So, let's see. Uh, let's say you start uh, here. Uh, where is this? Do do do. Landing, landing, where is the landing? Okay, let's uh, let's take this nearest city here. What's the nearest? Lumhurst should be here somewhere. Uh, ah, I'm in the black zone. Sorry, that's why I didn't see the city. Yeah, you start on the forest cross, let's see. The next first city is Lumhurst. When you start, when you start your uh, island here, uh, then you cannot move it. Oh, so be careful where you... Yeah. So if you travel now across the country or whatever, you have to go back here to go to your island. There is also... <clears throat> there is also travel planners in the cities. Look, this is like this uh, compass, yellow icons here. And uh, travel planner in the uh, royal continent here can travel you anywhere where you can travel through the blue, blue zones. So it means in Lymhurst, yes, you can fast travel to the bridge watch. Why? Because you can use all the blue zones. Yeah, see, but you cannot travel to the Carleone because there is red zones and the Carleone is the main trading city in this game uh, but if you want to the, go to the Carleone fast travel you have to go uh, naked you can't take anything with you anything not no single thing but if you want to travel like Lymhurst to the bridge watch and then you can have a uh, bag full of goodies and uh, and things but it will cost you more things in your bag cost you more to fast travel even it, it can cost even hundreds of thousands if you travel fast if you have really expensive loot here so check all the prices all the time uh, what was the one thing I wanted to say again ah okay uh, different cities if you check here, click. You have to click exactly near the city, not on the city. Like yeah, the city name. If you click on the city, you see here. You see the killed, which gets the taxes on the auction house. But if you click on the name, you see what's in the city. All the refining stations, crafting stations. Also, if you craft or refine, check out the usage fee. It will, it can be different. And if you see up here, this little uh, triangle, click this. And you see in this city, if you refine the fiber, 
you get plus 35 percent back so if you refine 100 fiber 35 is returned to your inventory it's very good return otherwise it's 15 so let's go to the other city bridge watch click here you see this is rock if you want to refine rocks go to the bridge watch if you want big return and see there is um, also different these shoes plate armor girl staff crossbow Uh, but here is leather shoes, arcane stuff, bone, sword, different weapons which you can get uh, uh, return. And in Carleon you cannot get any return. So this is only trade city. So let's go Martlock. You see there is hide, there is axe, quarter stuff, frost stuff. So if you want offhand items, <coughs> if you want to craft something, let's say you want to craft uh, let's say access so if you want to be axe specialist i will uh, say maybe martlock is the best place to put your uh, island i don't know maybe not but if you are skinner the hide 35 percent return is very nice also you have now now cities now cities that don't have certain goods if you go to those cities and trade the goods that they don't trade in is there a higher profit margin yeah there is so okay. there is so many difference in the prices also so um check before you sell <laughs> yeah there is uh, yeah it it can it can vary like uh Let's say yesterday I, I have three account, three um, characters in this account. Um, there is su such a book like Tome of Spells, which gives you uh, gives you ten thousand fame uh, when you use it, which is really much when you start. And this Tome of Spells in Carle Carleon City, the main trading city in the uh, center, will cost about 40,000 39 40,000 41 I was on the Lymhurst city and it was there 69,000 so wow so it was yeah like 35 40 percent more so there is difference yeah but be aware if you transport your goods, you have two choices. Use the safe route. I will show that also because other when I upload this video later on the YouTube, people want to understand. Uh, let's say you are. The, let's take this smart lock because let's say you um, you are Skinner and you refine your height, and now you want to go and sell the heights where is uh, where is less heights uh, less heights is definitely here uh, Fort Sterling because there is uh, mostly snow areas there is no um, animals to skin okay there is one place here but it's tier 3 and there is one place tier 4 and others is so far so you are in the Martlock you have two choices go straight I mean you need to uh, you need to cross some yellow zones and red zones when you can lose everything yeah or whew, check now you go one two three four five uh, let's go which fastest okay six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve zones <laughs> oh my god 
12 zones. Also you can wow. fast all you also you can fast travel, but it, it can cost you. But now you have to calculate. Does it cost you more to pay the travel cost to Martlock to the Fort Sterling? Let's say it's forty thousand. But you win I don't know sixty eight thousand. Okay, pay the price, done, done, and whew, you made your money. Or to the long road, take like, I don't know, 12 zones. It will take, um, okay, new people, it, will, it, it can take up to five, six minutes. So let's calculate six times 12 is 72 minutes. It's one hour and uh, 12 minutes just for riding. Just for fighting. So yeah, very interesting game, like you see. <laughs> but little tip: uh, if you want to check the prices, uh, go one city, put your things. Uh, in every city there is a chest. You can put your things. Take yourself to the uh, uh, naked. And just travel. And check the auction houses, check the prices, travel back, travel forth, and then you know the prices, and then you know what to do. But there can also be a waiting time. Let's say you 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 travel there, and uh, someone el else was there doing the same thing, and you wanted to sell, let's say, 500 hide. And then some bigger guy uh, came and, and now he put sale like 2000 heights. Now you have to sell cheaper or, uh, or wait. And this guy also can lower the prices all the time. You can al always edit your prices in the auction house. You lose a little bit because of taxes, but you can always edit. Yeah. Also, if you have this island, what I wanted to talk about, and you grow your crops, is <coughs> you can first you have level one island, you cannot uh, grow anything. Then you have to upgrade it uh, to level two. Then you can get one of this uh, field here, and their max level is tier six. So it is. Uh, it is wise to upgrade your island, I would say, because I have, uh, for to understand to you to understand this, there is, uh, you have three characters. Every character have uh, one island, and it's maxed out. So if it's maxed out, there is five. This is my last island. This is uh, only four places. So uh, I got one day. Here is uh, thousand and one hundred crops. Yeah. Wow. So let's see how much I get every day. I know, but uh, I don't know the, um, uh, this. Prices vary every day, every hour even. So let's see how much people in the Carleon. Oh my God! Ah, only three hundred. Okay, almost. So let's go here. Is the auction house oh 200 here have a look so now when you sell your things I will is this music too loud for, or this effects now to here I should take them down no I, ca I can't hear it Okay, uh, there is if you if you sell, uh, this is really good price. If you sell like instantly, you see you get two hundred sixty. If you want to sell the two hundred seventy is the price. I, I can sell two hundred sixty. So every time you sell, look now the buy price is two hundred fifty. Next is two hundred twenty two. I will sell these also. So I don't care about this price. And now these I sell two hundred, let's say sixty eight, and here. Prices have gone up, which is nice. So every time you sell something, uh, do I have something? Uh, say I want to sell my fishing rod. 
when I'm selling my fishing rod, see, they offer me only 1001 here. And in the red, there is minus 83% below average. Imagine if this is 1 million and the real price is 6 million. Yeah? You will lose 5 million. So be aware, don't sell instantly. Check the sell order first. Also, there is buy orders, sell orders. So you can know. So, yeah. So it was, let's say, 260 times 1100. I made today 286,000. And it took me 15 minutes. So it, uh, it takes about six months to get the. Uh, to get your um, islands up and what's that? Ah, oh, I can move 29 days, I can one time move my island, yeah. Uh, about six months to get your uh, island up upgraded and the thing is to get this thing here going. Mm. So be prepared for the long run. Yeah. Yep. So here, this T cell cultivator. Also, I have maxed out my uh, cabbage farmer. What it means, I will show you that also so you understand. This is really important. You can also put uh, buildings there. And so I'm going to go here and I want to uh, water it. It will cost me 125 focus. Yeah. When you start, it will cost you a thousand. But don't use this focus. Please don't use. Focus is really important. Refine your materials with it or craft your weapons because you get a return. Don't use your any of your focus on your crops, on your animals before this number is 500. Then you can use it. Otherwise, it's waste of money, waste of focus. Use your focus. Uh, I don't know. Okay, I will. I will go and refine some things so you you can see what's why the focus is good. Because you can make so much more return when you're refining. Uh, also, when you uh, grow your crops, you can get only place where you can get earthworms, and with earthworms. You can go to the this cook, and you can create simple fish bait, fancy or special. It also makes always make special, which will give you. If you go here, in ten charges, uh, it increases your uh, bite speed of fish two hundred fifty percent, two and a half times. It means if you. I will show you that also. Oh, it's night now. Let's see, I have in here is fishes. Go here. They have fishing rod in my uh, bag. This is mini game. You hit. Now, one, two, three, three seconds. Now you click your mouse. So this is mini game. You have to play to catch the fish, otherwise it fails. So it took me three seconds to fish to bite. Let's use the bait. Uh, this is you have to push number one now. Oh, ten tries. One, two. This is the like a bad example because it is so low fishes here. But when I'm going to the higher place where the fish uh, maybe bites after 10 seconds or 20 seconds and it is red or black zone where anyone can attack me, I will show you. Then every second counts, every single second counts. 
otherwise somebody goes and comes and attacks you. Because you're fishing. You're not ready to fight, you're fishing. <laughs> no. <clears throat> this is underway. This is the shortcut to the other cities. There is look, look now there is this um, number of hostile players you can see. What was this no? <laughs> Something happened? Mm, seaweed. Okay. If you get seaweed, seaweed is also really good. So keep the seaweed. Oh, tier 6 fish. Very good. Seaweed costs more than fishes mostly. But um, if you want to ask, is fishing profitable? Then yes, if you go up to... Uh... That's what I was just about to ask. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then there is, there is fishes, like I have got the tier 7 fishes, which is one fish is for, uh, worth 45,000. So yeah, but, but you have to get lucky to get this fish. Oh, there's one hostile there, see, one, uh, you can see there, of course I have hidden this, because some, ah, I see rough logs, why, because this fish pond is empty right now, let's go here, <gasps> my tool tire is too low, okay, I see if somebody wants to come and attack us, would be bad, Three fish. Also, they can um, they can be invisible and attack you uh, like surprisingly. So yeah, be ready to that also. See we again. Three times left. Ah, okay, now it's gone. So, how is your uh, tutorial going? Uh, going pretty good. I'm I'm going through it pretty fast. I'm just working on making me some uh, novice gear. Get rid of this beginner gear. Oh, very nice. Yeah. I want to I want to be prepared before I leave this island so Yeah if you, if you leave there is uh, there is no uh, nothing nothing to uh, afraid there because it's it's beginner's island and if, if people cannot attack you there you have to go like I don't know four or five zones away to find place where people can attack you Oh, I have last fishing this net. <gasps> I'm still I'm still slightly overwhelmed by how much is in this game. Wow. Ah, did you like, see? Like I'm. Yeah, no. Go ahead, bro. <laughs> I was I was fishing, and somebody uh, hit trade with me, and it will automatically cancel my fishing. So <laughs> it's so annoying. You can do that also. But yeah, talk. Sorry. Oh no, it's it's all good. Like I, I spent probably a good fifteen minutes just looking at the uh, the skill board. Yeah. You know uh, where you press B and look at all your skills. I just I didn't expect all that. There is yes, uh, so much to <coughs> so much to learn and understand and. And here is the black marketer in the uh, see N is the little one. so this red red one go here 
if we go here and you see the uh, buy orders so all these items here uh, what this guy is wanting to buy is player made and will drop on the world this is also very good place to make money I can, I'm, I, I'm making another video later, so yeah, I should starting to make this learning videos for people more. So I'm checking one second for the other chat here. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's that. Mm. Let's put the things away. I should go to the also the starter zones to check if somebody wants to join the guild, maybe. I really like I really like in the in the gathering aspect of this, how when you gather, you don't just get one item, you know? Yeah. Yeah, you... And uh, higher uh, you get, faster you gather, and there is even gathering gear after uh, you hit tier 4. So, so you can gather faster and there is spatial resources also. Uh, I will show you these. Like zone based resources? Yes. Um, okay, that's a good question. So let's hit M, map. Um, when you go to the zone, okay, let's go to this like uh, this pen grant here. The map shows it's uh, level 4, it's tier 4 map, if you hit the uh, name here. You see there is only uh, stone, uh, fiber and uh, metal. And down there is what level mat uh, materials there are. So then in the game there is uh, three kinds of um, rarities, there is uncommon, so you can see uh, in this map uh, there is 4.1 resources, 8% of chance. Then the new, um, what's called, uh, resource uh, appears, <laughs> let's say. 8% it can be 4.1, 0.8% 4.2 and 0.08% 4.3. So, which means, um, let's see if I have here all these, <clears throat> yes I have, okay, this is a tier 4 or it's tier 4, we can understand that, so when it is uncommon, this is like that, uncommon means this tier 4.1 is same quality as tier 5. So this is... Uh, so, so the resources have quality levels? Yeah, three of them. Okay. Oh, four, sorry. A zero, one, two, three. So zero is ordinary, like tier 4, which I talked. Then it's uh, this 4.1 is as good as 5. 4.2 is as good as 6. And 4.3 is as good as 7. Wow. So it means in tier 4, if you are a wealthy person, you can unequip yourself, equip yourself on the uh, tier 4.3. And I'm now as good as tier 7, which mostly takes me like 3 or 4 months to get there. I can be like in first day, but then I have to be wealthy. <laughs> you, know, you are what you wear. 
So so four months to get tier seven? Is that what? Yeah, usually it takes, yeah, four or five months maybe. Yeah, it depends how much you fight or. If you gather, you get gathering fame. If you fight, you get fighting fame. If you're using your sword, only your sword fame goes up. If you your spear, your only your spear fame goes up. So, you train. What weapon you train, it gets better. What armor you wear, it gets better only. But you can so this this game isn't really it doesn't I'm not gonna say it isn't but it doesn't sound like it's for I mean you can be a casual player of course but it sounds like if you're wanting to progress you can't really be a casual player ah uh, you can because I am I am almost a casual I first um, let's say six months I played every day two three hours then I haven't played this game when it came what when it came out now I play this game like uh, 20 30 minutes a day I only take my crops and two little little exercise exercise little quests maybe but I get these daily bonuses like now I get this chest I will see you oh, I get fame also oh Six thousand and get this, okay. And in the chest Holy crap, so much things. You get fame books, you see? I had here one fame book which will give me fifty thousand. But I get these fame books only four times a month. And then the one uh ten thousand one, yeah. So this will level you up also. Also, I get money here, hundred thousand. Thank you very much. And this, so yeah, it you can you can level up this uh, yourself uh, even if you play occasionally. Right, yeah, but it it still takes more activeness than most games I've seen. Yep, maybe that's true. Okay, this uh, Goku vibe asks, how do I make leather? So, how do you make leather? If you go here, this is your main circle. All what's on the right side is crafting and refining, or uh, which is on the left side, it's uh, growing or fighting so let's go down on the right side there is leather so let's see here tier 3 leather to make tier 3 leather you need two uh, one uh, tier 2 leather and two tier 3 heights then you go uh, in the city say here doesn't matter what city you are and you check this leather mark this is tanner you go to the tanner and there you can refine it so yeah you uh, kill first uh, these foxes or snakes is there someone else you get there two hides and uh, wolves and frogs you get there three heights. So you need both. Okay, let's see if I can upgrade something. Yeah, the skill tree first when also I started it was like, oh my god, so yeah, yeah. Oh, huh, tire bear rock. I I can't put in on my house. Why not? Ah, furniture furniture limit. Ay ay ay. We 
have to upgrade my house then. Tier 6. These blocks are expensive, I know that already. Okay, let's begin, let's try. Okay, let's go and sell some things. So, I am making metal armor right now, uh, soldier's armor. If I wear that in combat, that will level up my plate armor skill? Yep, true. Okay. So, um, to understand uh, what, um, what to become, I suggest that you look, you look to the a skill tree, you look these, uh, these here, these uh, fighter trees, yeah, whatever fighter it, it is, it is leather fighter or shield fighter or hammer fighter or axe fighter, because there is all the tier 4 weapons. The game begins when you are tier 4 because then the uh, abilities comes uh, which are like uh, like let's say let's let's take this uh, guardian helm there is uh, emergency heal instantly heals 10 percent of your max heal, health and removes any damage over time so the best thing in this helm is this overtime effects and also the heal but if you look the max helm at tier 8 it does exactly the same only only difference is that here is 173 max hit points and there is 285 and also energy and things some helms let's say here let's take this demon helmet very good thing your next normal attack will silence the enemy for 5.36 seconds so it means he can't use any spells 5.36 seconds but if you go to the max helm this is now 6.85 seconds some items uh, spells go grow uh, better with tears also so check also this and uh, this is artifact helm it means it means it needs this elders demonic scraps or this means needs adepts demonic scraps to make uh, and steel bars so you, you can ask for me what, what i can help you out night now because you're uh, in the chat what do you want to become what do you think uh, I want to do the quintessential knight, right? So a lot of people have the misconception that knights used a, a sword and board, right? A sword and shield. That's not what they used. So I want to use a two-handed weapon and plate armor, right? But really what I want to do is I want to be, uh, I want to be a noble merchant, if you will. So a murder hobo. Okay. So you wanna be knight, yeah? Knight, knight plate, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Plate gives you uh, defense and uh, can give you something else too. So uh, there is now a choice. Uh, if you now are money maker, like I hear, then in later in game, I think money is not problem for you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. So uh, then you can. Uh, why I'm asking that? Because if you if you go here, this is the plate armor fighter, and uh, higher you get here. As this is one to hundred, you see, yeah? Uh, yeah. The next, if you get level one, you get used tier four. If you get level ten, so if this is ten, you have now invested sixty-five thousand fame or got it means like if you want to get it in, uh, instantly 
you buy seven tomes and it is then seven times whatever 45,000 it is 315,000 and tra you're there but if you want to if, kill monsters you can get there what I will say is this will unlock only the higher tiers and give you only plus 0.2 bonus to item power for all plate armors, yeah. Heard. Okay, let's say there is 10. Level 10, you get passive bonus 1.8. 1.8. If you now go to there, this is specialization. If you take the same, uh, let's take like this. Let's take 10 here. You get 18. 10 times more defense, 10 times. Wow. But if you see the fame, it is 151,000. So it's not a little bit more than twice more, yeah? You need twice more fame, but you get 10 times more defense. So why do I... That's worth it. So this is to get higher tier equipment, this is to get more defense or attack power. And the second thing why I'm talking this is when you start using this, let's take this uh, knight armor, then you start leveling up this, also this combat specialist. You can later move your points. This is very good. They, uh, they did that. It means, let's say I have here, uh, which I have, uh, where is my armor? I have 72 in leather jacket, yeah? So I can use uh, tier 7 items. And I have now uh, 69 in defense. So I, I get 138 defense power in my letters. But let's say someday... I am tired of leather, or I want different leather, yeah? I am clicking here. Okay. Taking my points to, like, say, zero. Now I get 2.542 million, 2.5 million fame here, yeah? But to get this, I have to pay 953,000. Now, let's say I, I, I invest this 900,000, I get 2.5 million, yeah? So, now I take this, also take this away, it, it's half million and I get 1.2. So now I have 3.7 million fame, yeah? And I paid, paid almost 1.5 million, 3.5 million. Let's say now I want to go plate, yeah? I'll go here, let's say I want to go tier 7, this is 60, so 1 million fame here, yes, now I have plate, then let's say I want to take this plate, and I have uh, 2 point something left, and I can go here. I take my one points to the leather and put to the plate. You can do it. Okay. But I paid 1.5 million to do that. And usually they calculate that you lose approximately 15% there. Little fame lose is there. So it means if I have um, 4 million fame to take one place to another, then I lose about, uh, what, what's then, uh, 4 uh, million, 400,000, and uh, that to the 600,000 I lose, 600,000 fame there. So if I have 4, mi four million, I get 3.4 back, yeah? That's not all that bad, though. Of course not, because let's say uh, in... Um, we got we have five people we go to the guild run do some red dungeons 
uh, half an hour we can make hundred thousand so yeah it's not mu it's not much if if you do let's say if you do um, every week one or one or two dungeons with your friends it's totally okay to spend every month some millions to try another gear totally okay but so as as far as far as these different types of plate armor right uh which ones like i see there's the artifact guardian knight and soldier armor right yeah. what's the difference in those okay good um so if you click on the armor you see there is um this uh, these spells yeah uh, the difference, first difference is, let's say, armor class. Guardian is the normal armors, the best, like 2 2 2. Then it's knight, 2 1 1. Then it's soldier, 200. So the difference was 22. Yeah? Okay. So you see, you see, oh, 22, it's almost nothing. Wait. <laughs> let's take cloth armor. Normal cloth armor. It's 107. Yeah? Okay. Let's take leather. Which leather was the less. Yeah, this one. It's 137. So it's 30 is difference. Yeah? But leather and cloth difference is. It's pretty much. So. Right, but. But the. The, the different types of armor, the different sub-armors within that armor group have different skills, right? They offer different skills. True. As well. Yeah. And so, go, go ahead. I'm, yeah, yeah. Ask, I, ask, I have ask. a lot of questions. Ask, ask, ask. So, so if, if somebody was wanting to, wanting to build uh, a knight class build, Okay, where they wanted to use a Zweihander in in plate armor, right? Um, would they go for would they go for a defensive armor or would they go for an attack power armor? And as far as the two handed weapon goes, would they go for what what would they go for that as far as the skills that are offered by the armor and weapon groups? So um, yeah. No. Now you have to uh, look a little bit uh, like bigger picture. Uh, uh, what do you want to do with your two one that weapon? Do you want to get as much damage out of it, or do you prefer as much defense and uh, you don't care about damage? So let's hear. I want I want massive massive damage for me personally. Massive damage with my weapon. Awesome defense with my plate armor. Okay, good. Um, Let's see here. Uh, this has uh, energy drain, which is cool if you want to nerf the enemy. This has uh, aura, which 60% uh, takes damage down and slows. But you want damage, so you have here the spell uh, Fury. Uh, you get 7% damage bonus and 7% crowd control duration. It means if your weapons oh, have, let's right. say your weapon have root ability, root people. So let's say the root ability, it means people can't move, yeah? So uh, let's say root ability is 10 seconds. So you get 7% now more. But see there, there is uh, every time you take damage, it charge up 10 times and last for uh, 10 seconds. So let's say there is somebody who's making you massive damage, like every second is damage for you, yeah? So you get 70% damage bonus and 70% ground control donation now. That That is amazing. So the more damage they do to me, the more damage I do to them. Yes. That is, that's great. So then you ha then I suggest you take this. <laughs> that is well, I'm using fury right now with my sword and board, but I want to move into two-handed weapons. So so that that seems like that seems like it's a support armor, right? Soldiers is a support armor basically. 
right? So the would the the guardian armor I assume would be a self sustained tank armor. Yes, it's like defense. And then the not then the knight's armor would be like a semi mix between the two. The knight is uh, this wind war is that uh, you push enemies away. Uh, four seconds, they have to do like a uh, longer run to get to you. So it's very good to run away or all the group to run away. So you are like, you stay there, four seconds, we run away. But in this game, four seconds is ages. You can, in four seconds, you, you are so far gone <laughs> if you want. If you... Okay, so it seems like Guardian is what I want to go after then. Also, there is uh, there is very very expensive armor. Uh, it's Judicator. So see here, big force shield on the ground. Your resistance is up to eighty five, healing uh, received by thirty, and up to uh, ten allies. So only not for you, but ten other guys. But uh, resistances up to eighty five in this game. This is. This is crazy. This is this is like overpowered. Uh, what? Overpowered. Yeah, let's say. And see, armor is two hundred fifty. That was two hundred twenty-two. So this this is this is expensive. This is I think it's like two hundred thousand, and this is like uh, four thousand. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that's uh that's a bit expensive compared to that. Mm. The All right, so that that explained it to me good. See, I had I had that thought that that's the way armor and weapons work, but I wasn't quite sure. Yeah, so th there is this this Fiend armor will reflect fifty percent of incoming damages, but your resistance are decreased by eighty eight. So this is like other way around. And then there is a grave guard when when <laughs> it's very good. Attach the chain on enemy, and after three seconds, enemy will be pulled to your position, so it will like they can't run away. Oh, so it's single target control armor. Okay. Yeah. Mm. This is amazing. So, um, one second. I think I heard somebody. Uh, you can yeah you can you can change you can change uh, also there is if if you don't want uh, I think there is one good leather also you want uh, I'm using leather now uh, because uh, this is when you have a leather upgraded this is very good also there is uh, there is uh, uh, blood lost blood lust which is my or how do you pronounce it uh, every time an enemy uh, you, I damage an enemy you heal yourself for 39 lasts for 8 seconds or 15 hits yeah so uh, in this I will take my armor back where is my where's my sets here put this here so now this uh, this armor here I have, it will uh, give me two hundred one armor, yeah. It's almost the blade, like you see, but because I have upgraded it, like I have level tier seven, yeah. And this will give me fifty four heal every time. Now I'm using this Trinity spear, which has ability forest of spears. Repeated the attacks enemy, dealing 152 damage every 3, uh, 0.3 seconds. So it means it does 456 every second, eight times. So, but check here: eight times times uh, 54. It also heals me 436. So I did do damage and heal also myself. So that's how I use it. But this is the uh, if if you st uh, start uh, talking weapons, this is really really big damage weapon. 
the spears are uh, spear and axes are really strong. But yeah, uh, you you can do like if if you have now let's say you take this plate armor, yeah. So now you can think what kind of helm do you want? Do you want uh, do you want helm which 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 do what? Gives you more attacking power like poison, like I'm using this poison helm. Which uh, attack uh, gives like uh, coats your weapon with poison. Next auto attack will poison the enemy, damaging him 170 per second of five. So I do uh, an extra 550 damage every like uh, five seconds. You get extra damage there. Also, you can use the silence helm, which is very good. Uh, somebody uses these because when you silence, uh, you can can't you... cast, can't cast anything. Yep. Yeah. Uh, after you you know that next three seconds you are the king. He he, he just <laughs> moves, can't do anything. Uh, okay, he can do normal attack, but normal attack is almost nothing. So. He basically, they basically have to stand there and take it. Uh, yeah, they can attack. Uh, okay, um, if I look my weapon, then now my normal attack uh, will do one two hundred eighteen. Yeah. Uh, but when I use my stacks up, my normal is doing four four seven. If you silence me now, you still get four hundred damage every second. It depends how much. Not. Is there a way? Is there a way to change the skills on my on my hot bar? Right, like I want to move the skills around. Can I do that? Uh, yes, you can. Uh, like uh, if you take this, this is a different skills in your weapon. Yeah, you can you yeah. can you can change this, but out of the combat in combat you can't do it. How how do I do? How do I? Like the hot bar at the bottom of your screen, I want to move the skills around on that. How do I do that? Uh, move around where? Up, down, left, right? No, where it's Q, W, E, R, I want to change that skill line up. How do I do that? Mm. I didn't understand. Uh, explain, please, so again. Uh, okay, so for, for an example, I have interrupt set to W. Right, I don't want it set to W. I want it set to Q. How do I change that? Ah, uh, okay, that you cannot do. There is, uh, ah. yeah, uh, that's why uh, because the all your helms are, are D, all your um, armor is R, or your boots are F, or your weapon is Q, Q W E. So. That you all know, all, all, all the time you press the buttons, you know, Q, W, E is almost o always a weapon, and E is most strong one. Q is most fast one. So it's to, uh, I don't know why, but I think it's, it's to, uh, like, you know, every time. Oh. You're out to the, that zone already? No, um, I think I'm on the last part. Destroy mm. the fort. Yeah, after after you get this... Uh, you get out and there is a journeyman things, then, then you should think what, what kind of help, because you know already what kind of um, armor you use. Now is the helm time. And then it's the boots time, and then it's the weapon time, yeah? Uh, you can also be invisible if you want. You can jump away if you want. You can add damage in your boots if you want. Short, short time damage.
And what what kind of weapon do you think? I mean, uh, are there two two-handed weapons? I'd like to use two-handed weapons. Yeah, there is. There is uh, like I'm using spear. There is some spears which is two-handed. Then there is uh, there is some daggers which are like two uh, like two daggers, one in one and one in second hand. Then there is uh, axes and hammers which is two-handed. Uh, there is even maces which are two-handed, and there is even sword which is two-handed, two swords. A mega with a mace. Yeah, maces give you mostly HP, but there is there is also uh, damage in some maces. Two-handed maces. Okay, I think. So there's the artifact maze which which I used was the incubus one which will uh, the special abilities shrinks enemies in ground uh, go in front of you dealing damage 241 and uh, also when shrunk uh, the other ones uh, damage and heal power is reduced by 40 percent and max and current hit points are reduced at 25 percent for a uh, couple of seconds yeah or then there is, oh, you don't want the one hand, or the two one that uh, mace is also, you can silence elements in 4.5 meter radius, but you cannot then do damage, but you want to do damage. There's a lot I gotta learn about this. Yep, true. Okay, maybe there is Morning Star. Morning Star would be maybe if you. Uh, well, I'm looking. This is if, if because of two handed maces and you want to make take uh, make damage. Is there is this? Uh, all the maces have heavy slam, which like uh, unleashes heavy attack that deals 603 damage to all enemies front of you. Yeah, so you have to aim it a little bit. Uh, cooldown is 50 second and cast time is one second but in morning star you have the main spell is root prison uh, roots you and you and enemies around you up to four seconds ignoring enemies ground control resistance and after the channel uh, ends enemies will stay rooted for 1.5 seconds so yeah then then you then you could do the root prison and after that hit the slam you know so you're like um, most most of the time you do the 600 damage but oh no that's not good range is self yeah. uh oh disconnected disconnected wow what uh, there, um, there's, there's, in the zone I'm in right now, in the little area I'm in right now, there's probably two or three hundred people, man. It's crazy. <laughs> oh, I can't imagine what's going on there. Just go and do some challenges. I have only six thousand to go. Then I get my mount. Every, every. Uh, Every month you can get this special mount there. Oh, taking so long to go to the Carleon. Okay, let's see how many people there then. Ah, okay. 312, okay.
There's a lot of lag. Oh yeah, I I I also get this lag right now. So many people. Let's see if I go to the cell first, miss. Oh, disconnected again. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I think that this um, today is the most uh, intensive day. Tomorrow and after tomorrow, it's a little bit better, I think. All right, so where should I go? Swamp Cross, Mountain Cross, Highland Cross, Step Cross, where where should I go? Uh, the, uh, the closest for the Carleon is Mountain Cross, but it depends also what kind of resources do you want to gather, if you want to gather anything. I'll probably do smithing, so... Okay, then go to the mountain cross because then you need uh, mostly metal and a little bit wood. I, I can also come uh, near near you there. Help you out. Oh, because... wow. Oh, shit, I'm taking another. Uh, oh, no, I can go come with that. No worries there. Okay, how much people there you have? Uh, I can't, I can't see anything. There's that's that's how many people are here. Really? Yeah. Okay, I'm coming near you. You are now. Oh, there's wow. two dead people here. Somebody has killed. Ah, cool. Already, they are ganking, but only one. He's in this area right now, so I'm not afraid. How do I turn, rotate the camera? How do I do that? Uh, no, I think you cannot rotate. But there is, oh yeah. Uh, I think, come, uh, wait, um, I have to change the zone. Okay, maybe, maybe not. Uh, come to the... Uh, cross George, if you see the map, come to the Cross George. You can do your uh, this um, mission later there. There is Royal Chichil, which you can get. But if there is so come to where? Wow. Cross George is the next city up there, I think. Uh... Hit M map if you are there. Yeah. Oh no! What? Go my oh i got disconnect right now in the red zone that's not good what the hell game there's not so much people in the red zone come on no way i i sincerely hope that there yeah is... i'm i'm gonna come to there's too many people here i can't stand here i'm gonna go to where you said to go Yeah, go to the cross church because you can you can go later uh, to take to to make this starter quest because you already uh, got this um, one hundred learning points, yeah. One hundred learning points. Yeah, when you when you finished your mission. Yeah, I got a hundred. I got a hundred. Yes, I did. Okay, then it's good because you can do later this uh, this other quest, which gives you this royal chichil. The chichil is worth like forty thousand, but uh, it doesn't go away because you can do it later also. Yeah, I just I just need the the sigil to start my capital. That's it. I can give you money. You can keep it. So don't worry about that. Uh, what what is there a town here I should come to or uh, go towards the Fort Sterling? You see that if you go straight ahead, there is Fort Sterling. Uh, All right, towards. gotcha. Yeah, we can meet there. Yeah, 
and there was two cankers in this so no so ah people already want ah oh, come <laughs> but we can go to the yellow zone and i i can help you uh level up a little I, bit i just dc'd again well wow. yeah totally we'll go we'll go to a zone and and, and we'll party up and do so i i can't even connect Yeah, but this in the yellow zone, there is no. There's nobody. No, almost nobody. Yeah. Oh, you first, I think. Uh, oh, rarity. First three to five days, I'm pretty sure ninety percent of new people they will avoid red and yellow zones like plague. <laughs> like the plague? Is that what you said? Yeah. Oh man. Yeah, because uh, they they are so afraid, you know. And because I I remember my first uh, first days and weeks, uh, the yellow zone when I come or uh, if I go to red zone, my heart beat it so hard. I was like, uh, even if we have like two three people, like, oh, what's happening? What's happening? It's like, <laughs> what the hell? Because you, you were afraid every single one and cankers and everything. I got just coming through that pass. I got seven guild invitations. Yeah, I imagine. But I think that's 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 uh, if if people just running or going and people invite, it's like so what? I I don't know anything about this guild and you already invite me. It's like uh, yeah. It's like what's what's good about that? If somebody like in this, there is the uh, the guild channel, uh, which uh, you can you can uh, write your invitation, and then if somebody answers, it's like ah, now he or she is interested. I'm at Fort Sterling at what I think is the marketplace. Yeah, uh, soon be there. Almost there. Yeah, I don't. I don't think they expected this many players to join, and the server can't handle it. Mm. Uh, second and third day will be much easier because then. Uh... Yeah. Okay, you are in the marketplace, uh, the auction house there. Mm, I guess that's what this is. It's it's in the center of town. It's got a chest flag. A ah, chest flag. Okay, I'm coming down there. Did you go down? No, no, I'm standing outside. Ah, okay. And yeah, I'm... I waited. I'm coming up then. Back. Oh, there you are. Uh, ah, you are here. I know I see you. Yeah. Okay, send you invite. What? Awesome. I there's I've got let's see. Alright, I'm good. Alright, what are we doing? Okay, one second. Do you uh let's see I uh want to check your build also so um we can see if uh, uh what I have to buy to uh -huh, okay do 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 because when when we are going uh, now, you can you are leveling up so fast, you won't even understand what happening. <laughs> oh yes, uh, I invited you to party. Please accept. I I didn't. Okay, there we go. All right, I'm in. Yeah, cool. Then then then. So um, no, first is first. Is that a dragon? Where? Where is I'm it? sorry. Uh, there, there was a dragon. I'm excited. Just yeah, there is so uh, many different mounts in this game. 
I'm slightly laggish because of all the people, so you might have to take it slow. I hope that's not a problem. Ah, you don't have a bag yet? Okay, because bag gives you so much care. I, I will buy it for one second. Uh, I have some materials if you want to sell some materials. No, no. Uh, go down uh, this, uh, where is this chest and put your, uh, put your items away. So you get more carrying capacity. Uh, but uh, what do you think now? What kind of uh, what kind of helm do you want? So I I, I I want to buy you a little set so you can get up fast. So do you want cloth, leather, plate, helm? Which which this helm should do? Let's say all all plate all plate. What? All plate. All plate you want, really? Yeah, all plate. Yeah, okay. Okie dokie. Uh... I'm not. I'm not worrying about min max in this character because it's going to be a traitor. So, but I do know that I have to get into combat as well. All right, items have been deposited. Yeah, very good. One second, I will buy you a plate set. Oh wow, the logo's on my shield. Yes. So, where is the tier 4? I will buy you tier 4 so you can... Ah, then... Guardian armor and shoes. Shoes. This is this was shield. Hello, hello everyone. Hello. Hello, Sahib. Yeah. I know. I I have I I've not been very act active these days, but I'm in the game again. Don't worry about that. Take your time, whatever you need. This is not a competition. <laughs> yeah. I did a cargo to Limhurst from Fort Sterling with metal, and I gained 40,000 silver. Oh. Not bad. 60% 60, 60 of, the car, of the maximum car, um, I don't know how to say it. Yeah, very of good. The, it was good for me. Of course, of course. Every every little bit which you get is very nice because it will teach you all the time. Yes. Well, I only wanted to talk a little bit with you and now I'm going to sleep <laughs> and then I will connect, I think. If you want me to go to an uh, another uh, dungeon or something like that tell me in the chat because I read it and I will try to to stay there yeah okay no problem there okay mm. <laughs> I don't know my English is very bad sorry no worries no, it's all good man it's all good uh, have fun and see you later. Yep, yeah. okay, thank you very much. Bye, Sahib and Dalkar. Bye. Bye. See you later, man. I want to think what kind of mace do I buy you after this is done. I He's talking about his English, and I'm sitting here wishing I could roll my R's like you guys. <laughs> do what? <laughs> Uh, rolling, rolling your R's when you pronounce and pronounce a word with an R in it, 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 it rolls a little bit. Ah, okay. okay I, will, I will buy you this. I will do you little present there, so you'll be happy. I am happy. This is shit. Let it go. I'm, a, I'm a refugee from. Uh, RuneScape, so this game is kind of right up my alley. Mm. 
Okay, I'm I'm now ready to upgrade you and and let's go then. But uh, yeah, you are there. Okay, now I'm see. Stay there. I will trade with you. Whoop. First, I will give you tier three set because you need it first. I can't wear it yet. Yeah, yeah, no worries there. Just just take it. And put up at the where the bag. The bag is on. The bag is on. Very good. One second. There is one question in the chat. But the starting zone has too much people. Is there some? So go, uh, go, go vibe. Uh, go further. Whatever zone you are, go um, one to two zones farther from the starting zone. There is. Um, much less people but but before you go please finish your first quest so you get this 100 learning points it's crucial after that you got go further further because i i think you can't come back go back later and take this uh quest i am at one gorge wait 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 Okay, there is search option. I have to search one go. Woo. Ah, you are there. Okay, now I see where you are. You are, but go then someone else. Go to the Chillag. Chillag is farther away. You can go even the Stink Hawk. If you if you go, press M, like mount, and there's Chillag and Stink Hawk. Go two zones, or or then. Um, Another way, Pen Kerik and Pen Uchaf, just to the left, one or two zones, or to the right, and you should be good. Okie dokie, we are ready. We, I will also un unmount. Let's just run. Are you ready? Let's just go here. I lost you. Just, uh, I think you followed me to the uh, to the border. Yeah, there is southwest middle of. The, yeah, you are here. Okay, now I'm seeing. I'm seeing. Yeah. Now see see me. Yeah, I see you. I'm yeah. following. Then there is this this area. This is the yellow zone. So uh, if something happens, then uh, run. No. Wiggle. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no worries. No worries. Uh, I am from. I am here. Let's let's I kill. Will, I will fight to my death. Let's kill every single one here. Oh, sorry, I hit wrong. Damn. No worries. I think uh, we we should we we. Kill. I got a thousand fame just for killing that. Yeah. You get so much fame when when I'm leveling you. Soon you will you will be tier four, and then then you can see how much different it makes. Oh, there is dungeon. Let's go here. Let's go where? This is. I'm slightly scared. Yeah, Not gonna lie. don't worry. You just hang out, and 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 if if I'm going, oh, there's people there going first. Yeah, all all have died here. <laughs> Let's go further. Oh, poor ones. Yeah, there is really strong monsters there. Let's take this. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there is. Damn, it's so much luck here also. Wow. I died. So much lag. Wow, what's going on? This is the... Something is going on on the server. Because in here, shouldn't have lag at all. 
this yeah. is how do I how do I resurrect you uh, you can't wait I have to wait 15 seconds Wow something is going on there but but you get fame uh, you see you get 1004 I, I got no oh, no I got 5,000 fame for killing those things yeah yeah th that's crazy okay let's go further so we get taxed for picking up loot I didn't even have a chance to do anything all right yeah uh so can you can you already uh, wear tier three no uh i haven't checked no not yet okay let's go further that that's different that's uh, oh there is one hostile in here very good come here <laughs> a bad guy what wait you said a hostile yeah yeah there is one hostile in this uh there is okay there is too much no 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 let's go outside this in outside we can't get so much fame but okay let's see if we can see this hostile only only thing is the lag that i can't like react so fast oh there it is i had about two second lag so oh there is tier eight hostile holy crap what are you doing here trying to gank noobs yeah he's max level and try to gank what the hell is going on oh he's he's up i got gone away let's oh go. he's coming he's coming he's gonna cut us off no worries oh there's four more but we we don't lose anything uh apart of the durability of items and we can go to the next zone also Let's take these to get the fame. All the silver you got, you also get it, so don't worry about that. All the loot is also random, so you get loot if you get loot. I was just about to ask, is that what I'm seeing is shared loot? Yep. Oh, there is a chest here. Oh, and the rarity. Very nice. Hmm. Come on, guys. Oh, I'm lagging so hard. No worries. I'm taking this also. Do you see the little chest there? What chest? Aha! Here. Yeah. In this game, the, he, there is also hidden treasures and chests. You, you have to look because. Take the gold. I will take the rarity. This is the rare thing here. You see the the blue around here. It's yeah it's rare and um yeah if you see the rare then run. you want me to take it no no you can't take this okay let's go forward let's take every monster you have to uh use tier four tools to get uh, rares and uncommons and you all always can use uh ordinary tools uh one tier higher let's say you have tier three uh pickaxe to get metal uh, so you can take tier four ordinary metal but you can't take special uh tier uh tier four metal with tier three <clears throat> also there is this yellow and red lines when the monster hits you this is their special attack, like now, run away. Because usually these pet special attacks are pretty strong. But they have little, like, cooldown, so you can always run away. And uh, if you uh, come and gather, like, ordinary resource, like here, it's uh, uh, and or if you kill this 
this monster like this uh, metal monster here yeah the metal monster you kill you can gather uh, much faster if you killed it and there is a cooldown so if uh, you kill it uh, no one can come and uh, take it from you uh, one minute and 30 seconds Now I think the first week or two, three days there is so much rare items uh, like uh, like the, how is this um, rare pier time or what? Uh, how do you say it? It's so much faster. <laughs> Did you see what happened? <laughs> it, it, I can't dodge it because. Uh, I'm getting two and three second lag spikes. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries there. I just they are pretty strong these. Ah, you are coming to this resource. No, I want it also. Ah, I got it. Oh my God, that lag was really long. Holy crap! Almost, um, I'm close to leveling up. Oh, really nice. To, to tier three. Very good. Very nice. So close. Uh, do you see mini map? There is a skull jumping. Did you see? No, I, I don't see it. Okay, you uh, right down corner. This is the mini map there. Yeah. Yeah, I see the mini map. Yeah. If somebody dies, uh, there is a little skull jumping up down. Uh, so you know somebody died, like uh, in PvP. Oh, okay. Yeah, somebody just died there. <laughs> oh, the big that, monster, come here. That we... trident looks awesome. Oh, whoa. Oh, so much lag. Almost oh, man. Can't do I almost nothing. I, I see you just running in place. Yeah, no worries. I have. That was totally me. I, I dealt the final kill blow. It's all me. There is little bag on the ground, which is uh, do you see oh, right? This I is see it. your loot. If if it's if it if it's your loot, then it's uh, then it's uh, oh don't go there. It you can get killed. Oh my God! So I'm just standing here and can't do nothing almost. I I can't do anything other. Oh my God! Oh fuck! <laughs> Adept, Adept's rune. <laughs> oh shit! This game that is was so close. Oh yeah. Uh, one uh, one second. Uh, what are you guys doing? So Koku vibe. We are on the Kaim Kamein. Uh, we are um, leveling up. Uh, Talker. So um, you want to join? us you are welcome but you have to come for the Fort Sterling first so please let us know when you're there okay hold on I'm, I'm changing my skills I'm in tier 3 yep no worries uh, we're gonna put this on Mm -hmm. This on, this on. Take your time. I'm good. Hmm. Now you can also use, I think, 
uh, a tier three back. Uh, one second, I give you tier three back. Where are you? There you are. Take I cannot use tier three bag yet. Yes, but take it later. You need it. Good morning. Morning. Hello. Hey, Sahid. Uh, I saw your uh, YouTube video with an invitation for Albion. Yep. Uh, do you mind if I join you? Yeah, no question. Um, have you done your uh, these first quests for a real player? Or? Yeah, I used to play a lot uh, back in the days. Okay. Uh, cool. I just come back uh, for the uh, free to play launch. Uh oh, hot fix. Oh, game is coming to hot fix. We have three minutes. I can uh, invite you. One second. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What's your uh, in game name? I will type it in Discord. Yeah, please do. Yeah, I'm just uh, I'm just starting a new character. I will give you both, but this is the one I'm using right now. It's a new player, new character. This is new. This said uh, John Ly Lycan is old, yeah. No, like uh, that's uh, the one I want to use right now. This is my old one. For some reason, I just I just want to re-roll and <laughs> use the new one. Yeah, but uh, now I invite the old one, yeah. Uh, the new one, please. The new one, please. Yeah, but, but you are not online in with the new one. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah I, I'm, I'm just logging in right now. Just logging in right now. Yeah, let me know when you're. Yeah, yeah, sure. There. Yeah, just see the uh, link on the YouTube. I just wanna, you know, stop by say hi first. Yeah, that's nice. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm just a casual player right now uh, because my work is a little bit busy. I can't like always play the game like I used to be. Yeah, no worries there. We uh, the most important uh, thing, our vision, what in this guild we have, we want to do is uh, make the community so people yeah, can yeah. feel that they are uh, they are wanted here, they are needed here, uh, yeah. they are appreciated and everything. And uh, one rule is have fun. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Yes, that's uh, what I'm looking for. I used to be in a uh, black zone PvP every day, like in a guild. Uh, yeah, it was uh, for a long time ago, like about a year and a half ago, mm. almost two years ago. It was a second job that didn't pay you. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. That was good. That's sad, but true. Yeah, it is. It is. But the recruitment video is what recruited me as well. True. That's I went. Enough. I went. I went through six pages of advertisements, and this is the only guild that I saw that didn't have an ego. Thank yeah, you. it's uh, it's the one that I think fits me my new lifestyle the best. Oh, the server. Server is going. Cool. Oh my god. Okay. But it's good that they have the fix now uh, to let you know, uh, John, we are now in the Kyron Kama in the yellow zone, which has not so much players. And even in the private, uh, this uh, dungeon, hidden dungeon, yes. was like so laggy. I was like, what's going on? Oh, okay. There must be something wrong with that. Yeah, it was pretty bad. Yeah, shit. I need to. Uh... Okay, let's, let's close the client for a second and I will close the. Yeah, I'll close it. Let's just uh, yeah, chat a little bit. <laughs> I, will, I, will, I will end the stream for a second. So, see you later when the server comes up. Use uh, watchers there. <laughs>